Okay, I'm going to talk about not the bike, not the look bike, but the uh, the suspension that I have on it. What I have here is my first X-Fusion suspension, X-Fusion Velvet front fork and the O2 RLX rear shock. A uh, good friend of mine locally, John Valera, kept seeing my bike um, and uh, knew I wasn't totally happy with it and said, hey, you got to put X-Fusion stuff on your, on your bike, it'll, it'll, it'll wake it up. And I, I didn't really believe him, but I said, hey, I'll give it a try. So the first one I'll talk about is the, the Velvet. You know, I saw, I've seen this at Sea Otter, at Inner Bike, and see it everywhere, but it's kind of hard to get. You know, the X-Fusion has not been easily available to the, to the general public for, for years, but now they're saying they're ready, they're in production. <clears throat> So I think this is a, this is one of the best fork. This is one of the best products I've seen in recent years because it works. One, second, it's light. Third, it's cheap. Good, light, cheap. Usually you have to pick two, but this one I think you pick three. So weight, three point four five, three point four five pounds. Uh, my Fox and my. Um, um, uh, SRAM forks, RockShox forks are at uh, exactly almost the same, 3.5 pounds. Uh, price, 3.99, crazy cheap. But usually when you uh, you have something that's light and cheap, you you sacrifice performance. But um, not with this one. So out of the box, what do we do with our forks? We start playing with it. And when I when I started activating it, I'm all like, oh my god. There's no stiction at all, with zero braking. It was unbelievable. I had to call up John. I thought he doctored this fork or broke it in for me. But he says, no, that's straight out of the box. That's how smooth it is. Literally, one of the smoothest forks out of the box I've ever felt. On the trail, incredible. It's so smooth on the first ride, and it just gets better with every ride. Um, it's really a, a smooth feeling, but also controlled. You know, the, the damping is nice. Um, you can control the rebound right there. Um, this is a lockout lever. One of the best lockout levers in the business. Um, because it's big, one, and it's got, it's, it's got these detents on the unlocked position and the locked. Very obvious and very easy to flick. You know when you got gloves and you're riding on the bike, you want something as easy as possible and it's obvious when it's in, locked and unlocked. When it's locked, it's a pretty darn stiff lock. You know, I, I hate these lockouts where you can push it halfway. <laughs> yeah, you, you know, you, you want it locked pretty good. Um, and it, with this crown, with her legs, it's very stiff. Um, laterally. Unbelievable. That's just a normal skewer fork. Unbelievably stiff. So... It's a great find. Uh, the other thing, the reason why I'm sitting on this bike is it's what I do all day on this bike now. Um, this shock is incredible. You like the front fork, it is so plus. I, got, I have it kind of so, set soft right now. Uh, my son's been riding this bike. But it really woke up this bike. It is so active now. Um, quiet, doesn't make a peep, and um, the front and the rear just work in concert with each other. Um, so, you know, me and, my, me and my kid fight over this bike now. I, I, I wear, I ride a longer stem and offset post. But it's just so smooth and so balanced. Um, and it, uh, this one too has a very distinct lockout. You know, nice lever, click, you know, you're locked. You know, it's a platform shock basically, so you're, you're not completely locked. But it, um, it, it provides a great pedaling platform. So there you go. Um, it's an upgrade for less money. And there's not a lot of products you can give that accolade to. So my hat's off to those guys.